What's up you guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Lucas and in the video today, I'm gonna be explaining how I went from zero to 100,000 followers on TikTok in just one month. I'm gonna give you all the tips and tricks I use that I think truly blew my account up on TikTok so that you can do the same. I'll show a photo of my account right here on TikTok before it blew up and then I'll show a photo of my account on TikTok after it blew up. The first and most important thing when starting a TikTok is picking a niche. I cannot state this enough. You have to give people a reason why they should follow you and what they should expect from your content. For example, if you like clothing, you can do clothing videos. If you like gardening, you can do gardening videos. Literally anything that you like, there are plenty of people looking for that. Even if it seems like the smallest of smallest group, let those people know that that's why you're creating content and you will be the source for that type of content. This is one key factor into why I believe I blew up so fast on TikTok and I'm gonna refer to it as leveraging others hype. What I mean by that is if you show up on someone's For You page, most likely that person's not gonna know who you are because they've never seen your face before. But if a famous person who already has a name for themselves on the app shows up on their For You page, that person's most likely gonna watch because they're like a celebrity on the app. The way that I did it and the easiest way for me to explain to you is I used famous TikTokers and I told people on the For You page what they were wearing and where they could get it. Once I can hook someone in with a famous person and then provide value on top of that, it really allows the person to start to get to know me because they see me over and over and over again with these famous people on their For You page providing them that value. When I was first starting and really trying to grow on the app, I was posting eight to 14 pieces of content a day, which may seem like a lot, and it really depends on what your niche is. So if you're a makeup account and you know you can only do one video a day, make one video a day. But if you can do more than that, do more, because trust me, it is going to help your growth substantially. The For You page is such a mystery on TikTok, and I'm gonna explain to you why it is so simple and it is made for you to grow. The For You page on TikTok works just like the Explore page on Instagram, except it's way better. Now imagine if you were on Instagram and you were scrolling through and you were seeing new creator after new creator after new creator on your home feed. That's exactly what the For You page is on TikTok. Now how does that help you? Every single post that you make on TikTok is going to show to someone's For You page. Now they're gonna try to target that. So if you make a clothing video, they're gonna try to push that to somebody who they think will like clothing. This is why hashtags are also a big deal because if you hashtag your video the wrong thing or if you're just trying to use popular hashtags that don't make sense, most likely your video is not gonna get in front of the right audience and you're gonna have a really hard time growing because those people might not care about what you're posting. When you hashtag a video, TikTok is gonna see what that hashtag is and try to show it to people that they think that hashtag relates to. If they like it, share it, comment on it, engage with your video, TikTok's gonna think you made a really good video and they're gonna try to show it to more people and see how they engage with it. If those people engage with it, TikTok is gonna push it onto even more people and that's where the real growth on your video and your account truly happens. And as long as your video keeps getting engaged with with these new groups, your video is gonna continue to blow up and allow new users to see you, which in turn creates followers. Use hashtags that are relevant to your video, but use the ones that are in the sweet spot. What I mean by that is don't use hashtags that everyone has already posted on that have a billion plus posts and don't use the ones that have no posts. Find the ones with 50 million, 100 million views. That's where I've had the best luck because you want your video to rank in the search when people are searching for that hashtag, just like you might in that same topic. The biggest part of that though is hashtagging the video the correct way and making sure TikTok knows what your video is about. Hopping on trends is a great way to grow on TikTok only if it's relevant to your niche. If your niche does not relate to the hashtag that is currently trending, do not hop on it because your followers will watch watch the video and get lost on why they're following you and realize that you're not posting the content that they followed you for. But if your account is able to hop on the trend, feel free to make a video that relates to your niche and relates to the hashtag because it could see a lot of growth for you. I hope this video has helped you out. It's really all the things I've used to make my account grow on TikTok and hopefully you can get some use and implement them into the content you wanna create on TikTok. If you wouldn't mind hitting the like button, it truly does help me out with the YouTube algorithm. Also comment your TikTok down below. I would love to check it out and I'm going to be reading and replying to all comments. And as always, much love.